When COVID-19 hit, many people were forced to put their summer travel plans on hold. But once campgrounds began to open up, RVs and trailers became a very popular option. We visited Niagara Trailers recently to find out more. First couple weeks when we opened, it was uh, it was it was slower than normal, if you could say that, right? But it was uh, it was a nice pace. We were selling trailers every day. Uh, first couple weekends were a little busier, but then when the when the area went into what we call, I guess what they call phase two, uh, then it become extremely busy. And the month of June, our sales were record sales over the year before. July appears to be the same. So it's really, really affected the, the overall sales of operations. Uh, also getting product to people. Uh, we had that six weeks we were closed, so we've had a backlog with that. But overall, it's uh, it's been really good. I mean, people are using their RVs, road, having a good time with them and uh, enjoying them. Are you seeing a lot of newbies joining the RV world for the first time? Yeah, we are. We've got obviously that base of campers we've always had because Niagara Trailers is almost a 50-year-old company. So we have a large base of people throughout southern Ontario. But what has happened, we've got a lot of new campers. And what I'm finding after talking to people, these are people that were thinking of possibly doing this, maybe not this year, maybe next year, even maybe three or four years from now. But what it's done is it brought them forward because they haven't got other stuff they can do. So, yeah, we're definitely finding a lot of new campers. And uh, they seem to, the ones that have picked them up, seem to enjoy it. Like They, they already like the outdoor lifestyle so they're I wouldn't say they're technically new to camping or that type of thing but this they've sort of moved their purchase forward I guess when I'm getting out. John what do you do to train these newbies to learn what to do once they have bought their trailer? We have a, a two-hour orientation with every pickup, and sometimes that can last a little longer with somebody that is new, so we allow for that extra time. So we go through the trailer from the front to the back, showing you how to use your propane properly, how to hook your water up, how to discharge your waste, and then we go through the how to bring all your slide outs in, operate your awning. A uh, lot of the new trailers obviously are a lot more electronic, so they're a little easier to operate, but we also sell a lot of pre-owned units. It's still a manual system, so we need to show them that. Then at the end, we kind of what we call marry the two units together, so we teach you how to do your hitching properly and then we take you for a little test drive around uh, St. David's and make sure you're comfortable with it. So it's a yeah we make sure before they leave two things the unit is safe they understand how to use it okay and that they can enjoy it. What do people need to know before they actually take the plunge? Well, the biggest thing is knowing what, what your tow vehicle is and what it can, is capable of towing, right? That's that's always, you don't want to get a trailer that's too big, and we wouldn't let that happen, but you kind of want to know what is going to be your tow vehicle, or are you going to park it? So you have to kind of know, is this something I'm going to travel with, or I'm, my long-term goal is I'm going to find a place and just stay there, because that changes your your purchase. So, because here at Niagara Trailers, we deliver trailers to, to sites and set them up too. So we do about three of those every day. So we can actually, you can buy a real big trailer if you want, even though you got a small tow vehicle, because we can take it somewhere and park it for you and set it up. So once they know that, then it's really knowing you know how many people they want to accommodate and really what they're going to use it for. Is it something you're going to use just for weekends? Is it going to be family vacations? Are you eventually going to be, when the border opens, is it something you're going to take down south and maybe use in the winter time as a snowbird? So once we know all that, then we can help them find the right unit. Like at Niagara Trailers, we sell 13 different brands so we don't necessarily have to put everybody into the same pigeonhole we can actually take your information and find you the right the right rv john looking at how some of these trailers are set up it's not really roughing it when you travel by rv is it no i mean if you go inside them i mean if you look at the furniture that's in them the the stereo systems the tvs uh, they're all most of them all have electric awnings uh, a lot of them have electric jacks now our bigger units actually self level themselves so you don't you actually get out and you press a button and it actually levels the trailer for you so yeah I mean RVing has changed a lot especially in the last 15 years like if you really go back you don't really see even if you're looking at a 10 year old like a pre owned unit is 10 years old it has a lot of those already those features already starting at that time so you don't have to buy something brand new to get a lot of those new features in Niagara on the Lake, you're watching The Source.